Haha, <risos> como é que é meus amigos aqui com vocês é Ruben Alves Baica, sejam todos muito bem-vindos a mais um episódio de Red Dead Redemption 2. Arrebentem com o like, subscrevam o canal se não são subscritos. Desse lado espero que esteja tudo bem com a vossa família, espero que esteja tudo bem contigo, espero que esteja tudo bem com, com os vossos amigos e com os vossos animais de estimação. Arrebentem com o like, subscrevam o canal e vamos então dar início a mais um episódio de Red Dead Redemption 2. Venham daí amigos, let's go guys! O Dutch está cada vez pior, para o que, pelo que viram no último episódio, né? As suspeitas que eu, que eu tinha sobre, sobre o Dutch estão cada vez mais a confirmar-se. Nunca pensei foi, foi que ele fosse fazer aquilo fez no episódio passado ganda porco dá-me vontade de estar ao pé dele e dar-lhe duas chapadas na boca para quem falava tanto em lealdade pelos vistos não sabe o que é que significa Vamos a chegar. É, tempos. Eu ia já direto ao Dutch para estar já uma pera na boca. Esperem só aqui um bocadinho tirar aqui o um marcador senão ia ficar sempre ali. Well, at least you ain't run off. What you talking about? Pearson left. Old uncle. The traitors. Both gone. At é, traitors. They said Tilly they were running to save themselves. I think Mary Beth left as well. So it goes. They are goddamn cowards, Arthur. Cowards. Of all the time we spend to run off. Well, I guess they don't want to die, Dutch. Ain't nobody gonna. <coughs> This is a tough time. And you ain't you ain't doing too well. But we, our community, we will survive. They will not crush us. I hope so. But If we let Jack and the women free, well then There maybe no we can freedom for no one in this country no more, Arthur. One more big score, we got enough money to leave. All this turmoil has the army and Pinkerton spinning, we take a boat and slip away. I don't know what you're saying, Dutch, but it seems like I've heard it all before. Just one more. And I'm always a goddamn train. Arthur, <coughs> this is different. <laughs> We know this is full of cash. Army payroll, money and supplies to repair the bridge that you blew. This is all going to plan. We rob Uncle Sam and we leave. <laughs> the poetry of it all. What do you think? It sounds wonderful. Hell, I ain't got much to lose, but You gotta do what's right and cut some loose. John and his family, I, I'm afraid I have to insist. I mean, we gotta let him go, because if the Pinkertons come through again, they will kill everyone. John? Insist? Yeah. Insist. 
course, pal. Whatever you think is best, I will see to it. Huh? Now, we gonna rob a train? Sure. We will survive. We will flourish. We have work to do, my friends. Let's go. Come on. We are gonna borrow a little money from old Uncle Sam and be out of his hair once and for all. He insists upon it. He insists. Let's ride out, gentlemen. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Vai dar merda. Querem uma aposta? Se vocês repararem bem, eu e o John Marston, ou neste caso nós e o John Marston, somos duas pessoas de quem eles querem ver livre. Pé da merda. Got it. All right. Let's get this done. Round up, Arthur. You think this is gonna work? Who knows? I don't trust nothing no more. Have <laughs> mess in the oil factory. I swear he looked me in the eye and walked away. Like with me in the bank. But listen. Abigail just told me the money it's hidden in the caves at Beaver Hollow. What? Yeah. So much for never hiding it near camp. Dutch was getting even sloppier than we thought. Okay, well, let's get through this job and make a plan. Get the money and get the hell out of here. You, Abigail, and Jack go live your life. And you? I reckon. Head out west, someplace dry. See if I can shake this goddamn car. But first, we got one last train, John. One last train. Concord. Acho que é o melhor a fazer. Oh, coming together, Dutch. 
Just like we planned. Is that okay with you, John? Arthur? Or do you insist on something different? Sounds about as good now as every time I heard it before. Oh, Abigail must be real excited. All packed up like she is. I could just see her in a little grass skirt. Don't talk to me, you son of a bitch. Boys, boys, okay now, let's keep it down. We don't want to draw attention to ourselves going through here. Nice and easy through town, fellas. Ah, uh, Saint-Denis. It's good to be back. Happy memories, huh, John? Will you shut up, Maka? That's enough. Fire. All of you. Not much further now. Grandes malucos. Era mesmo eu que punha ali os cotes. Depois de tudo o que se passou, era mesmo meu. Não haja dúvida. They stop the train. Here she comes. Should I just sneak on now? God damn it. Well, everybody mount up. We still going through with this? Of course we are. É o que eu estou a fazer, né, filho? Já cá estou. Bora, 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 bora. Quanto fiz? Então o que eu estou a fazer? Get 
Bora, bora, bora. Não passa. Vamos lá. Bora, bora, tô aí. Como é uma marmita? Vai tudo arder, estou mesmo a ver que aquilo é que era a cena da guita. Já foi. Aí é com caras. Calma, filha.
Bora, 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 bora. Eu carrego para acender e o cheval não acende. Ai que maravilha. Bora, vamos mais a buscar money, 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 money. Tu queres, tu queres, tu queres, tu queres é money, money, money. Isso aí mas é daí, mano. Bem, conseguimos a guita. Where's John? I tried. I tried. He didn't make it. That patrol killed him. We had to run. Come on, let's go. Before another patrol turns up. Ha! Ah, vai ser uh, cutscene. Estava aqui a ser eu a conduzir. Já ia pular. Eu dava a base. Ficava com a guita desde um queijo. Tango, morte e redenção. John's, uh, well, sorry, son. Without John, she's just bait. We got a bunch of money, Dutch. She's just a girl. They won't do nothing to her. But me and the boys know. Yep. We need to keep riding on this one, Dutch. You know it. Every man here knows so we it. we just gonna let the boy be made an orphan? It, it ain't like that. What is it like? I wanna live, cowpoke. I still got the choice, Dutch. It's just a girl. You're right. Dutch, Micah, it pains me to say it, Arthur, but he's right. Dutch! Come on, boys. Well, I guess that's that, then. All them goddamn years. Come on, Arthur. Let's go get her. You and me is all we need. Miss Tilly. Here. Take this. You take this money too. Take Jack. And you wait at Copperhead Landing for Abigail and Mrs. Adler. Thank you, Arthur. And just get out of here and go live your life. This is done. All right, Arthur. I'll 
I'll miss. No. Nah, don't start with all that. Yes, sir. Jack, come here. Be brave, son. I'm gonna go get your mama. Mrs. Adler. Ride with me. Ah! If they're putting her on a boat, they'll probably dock at the north end of town. So I reckon we should go in the other way. Sure, I guess. Oh. God, those goddamn bastards. Look, just follow me, okay? We're gonna get this done, Arthur. gonna be all right. We're gonna get Abigail out. Of course we are. Because we don't leave our own behind. That's what Dutch taught us. Well, seems his mind got changed on that idea. Like I remember one time years ago, he was right these robbing this house. Saying, that man was too poor. How taken from him was no different from the system we was fighting against. É um can... andam a comer a cabeça um ao outro. Então, um cavalo. Vá, ah, anda lá. Estás bem ou vais para Belém? É isso. Abigail knows where the money's hidden. If we can get to her in time, we might be able to get to it before they do. <coughs> Let's just get her out first. See it? Mac, Davy, Jenny, Sean, Lenny. Now, John, we have to put an end to this. <laughs> and Eagle flies. Another angry young fool he used, just like he did with the rest of us. Like I said, our friends, we don't need them. We're gonna make this right. Me and you together. <laughs> What's left of it. Now come on. E tanto dinheiro que eu dei, que eu dei lá para a gangue. Para aqui. Para satisfazer o Dutch. Ok, aqui estamos. Vamos ditchar os horses e vamos com um plano. Claro que eu não estou arrependido de ter dado dinheiro, né? Não era só para, para o Dutch. Mas se eu soubesse que isto ia ficar assim. Como você está se sentindo? Estou bem. I think you should cover me and I'll go in there and get her. Because you're the better shot, I mean. That ain't what you mean. I can still fight. I know, Arthur. But just do it my way, honey. It's for the best. Get up someplace high, like the lighthouse or something. And cover me. Please. Okay. Get Ah, nem. Eu acho que este ainda vai acabar juntos. Se não acabar ele, acabo eu com ela. É. Ensino ela a história dos três porquinhos. Como disse em live. E era bem ensinada. Hoje, que isto nunca mais acaba amanhã. Ah, se, der, se tiver que ser dado de fuga, não sei não. Ok, Mr. Milton. Onde você está? Eu dava-lhe era já. Vai. 
Vai andando que eu vou... Que eu vou limpando. Mais aonde? Está aqui. Mais onde? Aqui. Mais onde? Eu não vejo mais ninguém. Ah, está aqui. E estas imagens são mesmo... Ah, sacode. E aí ela está ela ali. E agora? da merda. Eu tinha lhe dado logo um tiro de sniper. Vida, chaval.
Já está, vamos embora para cima deles. Just fine. Mm -hmm. We offered you a deal, Mr. Morgan. You should have taken it. I'm a fool, Mr. Milton. Not all you boys have quite so many scruples. Old Micah Bell. Micah? You mean Molly? Molly O'Shea? Sweated her a couple of times, never talked a word, had to let her go. Micah Bell. We picked him up when you boys came back from the Caribbean. He's been a good boy ever since. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Using your strength, Mr. Morgan. You're still a yapping dog, Mr. No. Bem jogado. Horrible man. Now come on, both of you. Peraí, tem que ser assim. Calma, miúda, sou só um e doente. Agora é, é o grupo que andava aí a. É uma maguita. Até parece que não sabes. John, where's John? I, I don't. Know. Arthur. He. What? He got killed or he got captured. No. I'm really sorry. No. Abigail, I'm, 
I was on the train and I didn't see it. No. <laughs> Listen. We got Jack. He's safe. Mrs. Adler will take you to him. But, John, I want you to know this. He loved you. He loved you, and Jack, he did. He wasn't perfect, but he did. Now, you gotta go get that boy. Come on, get out of here. What? Arthur, what are you doing? I gotta go have a little chat before I get much sicker. No, Arthur. Don't you owe Arthur me. Neither of you two. Not now. You both know. <clears throat> I gotta go settle some things. For me. No one else. You go get that boy. There'll be time for sorrow later. If you're headed back there, Arthur, take this. I don't need it anymore. What's that? There's a chest in them caves, in the back to the left, hidden under a wagon. Duchess chest. All our money. I know John told you I knew where it was. Abigail Roberts. Always was a good thief. Mm -hmm. Go on, get out of here. Yeah. Olha, ele sempre teve o chapéu ali na bolsa. Toda arrepiada, God. I see clearly that your world is not a world from which one can escape. Yeah, and I'm breaking it. May the wind be at your back. Right. Good fortune touch your hand. May the cards lay out a stray All from your command That's the way it is Ih, me arrepia tudo Está aqui uma cena do caraças, hein? Tem no lugar dele. E é verdade. Se ficarmos focados muito tempo na mesma coisa. E não olharmos ao redor. O que vamos ver é, é tudo ir embora. Ia passar por nós e nós nem demos conta. Get them bags packed up quick, Miss Grimshaw. Come on, all of you. Well, we're doing our best. Hurry, we ain't got long. Hurry. We just got plenty of time, Micah. Uh -huh. We all need to have a little chat. Black Long, you're back. Hooray. <coughs> I just saw Agent Milton, Dutch. 
Abigail shot him. She's okay. Not that you care too much about that. You rats. All of you. Seems old Mark here was pretty close with Milton. What the hell are you talking about, cowpoke? You talked. That's a goddamn lie. Dutch. Dutch. Think of the future. Uh -huh. He told me. <laughs> and you believe him, Black Lung? You believe him? It all makes sense now. No. It damn well doesn't. Dutch. Think. Dutch. Be practical now. <laughs> Dutch! John? You left me. Okay. You left me to die. My boy. I didn't have a choice. John, I didn't. You! I didn't have a choice. You left me! Gandas porcos, outra vez, é a segunda. You pick your side now because this is over. All them years, Dutch, for this snake. <laughs> oh, be quiet, cowpoke. Be quiet. You live in the clouds. No, you be quiet, Mr. Bell, and put down your gun. There's Pinkerton's coming fast. Hey. Now. Who amongst you is with me? And who is betraying me? Well, I'm here. Think. Think for yourself. He's lying. He's lying. Put your guns down! God damn it! Move! You ready, John? Yeah. Everyone get down! This is Danger Ross! The Pinkerton Detective Agency! Put your guns down! Quem vai baixar as armas aqui? Sacode o bruxo. Ah, caraças, ele limpava-vos o sebo. Pois também fizeram isso connosco. Ganda porco. Mais ou menos, bora lá. Safe. So's Jack. Where are they? It was Sadie. The Copperhead Land. Thank you, brother. I want you to not look back. Like I said. Oh, so cold. 
Ainda temos que levar com este. Mas tem vai limpando-os aqui pelo caminho. Deixa-o estar, bora, bora. Eles encontram-se ali pelo caminho. Não, a gente vai. Eles encontram-se aí. Toma, não morres. Dead in five minutes. I got a family. That's more important. Ah, uh, maybe you're right, but uh, you want the money? You head down. I gotta go to my family. Arthur, just make the call. I'm coming with you. I'm gonna get you out of this bullshit. If it's the last goddamn thing I do. Thank you. Ah, shit. Let's go. Também não me servia de nada o dinheiro. Eles também são cegos, eles, eles não veem nada à frente. Nada a fazer, filho. Mete lá aí atrás da pedra. Bora, bora.
Oh, palhaço. Vai lá para baixo. E eu também fui. Cabeçada nos queixos. Anda, solta, solta. Dá-lhe como ele merece. Sacode. This is where it ends for you. Pumba, 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 pumba. E quem que achas que vai perder? Oh, Black Lung! You ain't gonna reach that gun! You ain't! You lost! My sick friend! You lost! Anda lá, anda lá, anda lá, anda lá, anda lá, anda lá. É, It's over. Oh, Dutch. He's right. You know it, and I know it. He's sick. He's dying. He's talking crazy. There,
Come on. Dutch. Let's go, buddy. We made it. <laughs> we won. Come on. John made it. He's the only one. <laughs> the rest of us. I tried. In the end, I did. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Let's go. Foi o único que ficou com com algo no meio disto tudo. Ficou com uma família. Come on, Dutch. Come on. You're not better than me, Morgan. Whatever you say, you fool. Damn you. Damn us both! Pois a vida não para. Mas ele morreu. That was close. Too close. We brought that trouble on ourselves. By we, you mean me. The one me who went and shot him. Seemed like he deserved shoot. I'm sure he did. But I've been thinking, ain't it about time you stop being the man making them decisions? I'm trying. Are you? I think so. We gotta find some place to lay low. Keep quiet. Maybe Dutch was right. Maybe we should have just gone to Tahiti. Is that it with you? Tahiti or killing? Come on, John. Please, try. Try what? We gotta live somewhere for more than just a few weeks. Okay. Let's see what we can find in... in Strawberry. What do you know about Strawberry? I know they like good, honest, hard-working men a whole lot more than angry killers. So make yourself good and honest. I am always honest. Maybe not always good, but I'm always honest. My whole life I've been surrounded by fools with moral codes. Here's the moral code. Look out for folks. Stop trying to act like some hero in a book. What do you know about heroes and books? My reading's getting pretty good. Well, read different books then. The books is Jack's. And, well... Maybe he's doing most of the reading, but still. You're a bad influence on your mother, boy. Boy. Sorry, sir. What was that? I said you're a bad influence on your mother. Which books? Which books was that? You know that dime novel, or Boy Calloway and the Men from the Moon, or whatever it was. I'll do my best to find better reading material, Pa. Is that what you like, then? Western tales? Boy. What's that, sir? Do you enjoy tales of the Wild West? Don't be reckless now. Not so much anymore. I've been reading about knights. You know. Vamos chegar ao nosso destino e finalizar o episódio. There's King Arthur. 
Ganda de gosto. O Arthur Morgan morreu. Para as mãos daquele palhaço. Rato. Deixa eu ver se dá para gravar. Não dá. Pois estamos em missão. <risos> Já arranjamos o um, um inimigo aqui. Tava doido, tava. Thank you, doctor. Hey, how are you getting on? I oh, found some work. Me too. Delivering goods out to some ranch. Cleaning a doctor's surgery. Fine living. It is, John. Oh, it is. This is the way to it. I'll take your word on that. Well, what do you suggest now? I'll stay here and get on with the work. You deliver them goods and then collect me. Okay. And John, I love you. Don't you forget that. Not ever now. I won't. Now we're doing biscuits. Ah, shall I wait now? Pois estás em missão, burro. E o episódio vai ficar gigante. É. Tenho um save para fazer. Olha devagar. Oh yes. Para cavalinho. Puxa aí. Bora cavalinho, puxa aí a mim e as cenas do teu patrão. Não é bem patrão. Mas eu acho que a gente ainda se vai encontrar com o Dutch. Mais lá para a frente. Damn. Easy there. 
Estamos a perder coisas pelo caminho. Já deixámos um animal para trás. Morto. Um coelhinho. É sempre a abrir. Ainda falta muito. Ele não sabia onde é que era, mas sabe os potes que lhe falaram. Os ranchos todos e, e as cidades e as localidades e as vilas e as aldeias. É tudo com ele. Ele é melhor que o GPS. Ah, tem aqui. Mas acho que não tem em todo lado. As tabletas. Está a ver que nunca mais. You Mr. Geddes? No, sir. I'm Mr. Dickens, his overseer. Jim Milton. I'm delivering some supplies from the store in Strawberry. Okay. This is quite a place. Yes, it's beautiful. Oh. They send everything? Yeah, I think so. So, partner, your boss, he looking for hands? Why? You looking for work? Yeah. My wife, we was in business with her family and turned sour. It's a long story. Yeah, I don't know. Married hands. It's a lot of trouble. I'm a good worker. My wife, Agatha, even our boy, Lancelot. We'll all work. Big man around, boy? Get the hell out of here. <laughs> Now, that ain't very neighborly. And threatening us is neighborly. <laughs> hey, mind if I enjoy one of these apples? Put that down. <laughs> Delicious. Oh. When's uh, Boss Man gonna sell this place, boy? I don't think there's any plans for that. You boys want a drink? It's some fine scotch whiskey. Put that down. Put that down. Oh, these supplies for the season. Get off the farm. Come on. <laughs> we know when we're not wanted. Get down from there. <laughs> Bye, bud. <laughs> you come back here. You can use that horse. And don't get yourself hurt. Or hurt them, for that matter. É burro. Dá lá, pega o cavalo. Eu gostava era de saber como é que a gente vai fazer isto. Tá feito. 
like you. Milton, isn't it? Those boys are out of Laramie. Work for Mr. Abel. Thank you. Don't mention it. Listen, I ain't looking for no charity or nothing, but I was serious. You got work? We'll work. I can do anything. We got... We got robbed ourselves a few days back. We ain't got married hands here. You're married. I work harder than any one of them. I'm real honest, and my wife, even though she's got fancy thoughts, she'll work. You seem kind of desperate. What trouble you in? No trouble, sir. Aside from her brother, he tricked us and robbed her of her inheritance. We're good people. We'll work. Even Lancelot. <laughs> what does Mr. Gettys need with a boy? Just another mouth to feed. Just please. Oh, that's a trouble. Let me touch part of myself, okay? You know that already. Yeah, makes me wonder just who would have robbed you. But we'll give you a chance. I'll let Mr. Gettys know when him and his wife return tomorrow. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. I'll go get my wife. Nah, no, you stay here. It's getting late. We'll go get her in Strawberry. We'll bring her here tomorrow. She needs you around in case any more of them Laramie boys turns up. There's a. A little cabin out yonder past the ranch house. Things work out, y'all can stay there. Thank you. You'll not regret this. Yep. Go get yourself settled. We'll have work for you tomorrow when Mr. Geddes returns. Nice. Epílogo, parte 1 Missão concluída, a vida não para yeah, Agora temos uh, missão a fazer É. é aqui o mapa. É, prazer simples é Abigail e o Jack devem chegar na sua cabana no rancho Pronghorn. Ok. E há mais alguma missão para fazer? Não, é só esta. Ok. Bem meus amigos, vamos ficar por aqui neste episódio, espero que tenham gostado, arrebentem com o like, subscrevam o canal se não são subscritos e, part... e... e subscrevam e... e é isso, daqui com vocês foi o Ruben Alves, Baica. ainda estou aqui a... meio abatido por causa do... do Arthur Morgan ter morrido às mãos do Michael Bell, aquele rato, palhaço, dá-me a raiva, só me apetecia, era lhe desmorrar a boca toda, mas pronto. Mas o okay. quê? Daqui com vocês foi o Ruben Alves Boica. Até à próxima e fui! Obrigado! Haha! <risos>